Yo, yo, so I'm doing two videos today. Um, I was at Potomac Cars and Coffee, which unfortunately got shut down a couple weeks ago. Cool show, and unfortunately it's gone. But I met some really cool guys. Uh, one of the guys I met is Brent. Um, I'll post his Instagram down below, but he's got a beautiful CLS 63. It's got the methanol injection. Um, it's done by Modern Masters, I believe. One, I was talking to him and he, we were talking about air intakes and we we're talking about the Black Boost and we were also talking about the risers. And one of the things he asked me is, you know, what do the risers do? So I thought that would be a pretty good question. Them. But basically you can see here that we have some like a separate part that's a little bit metal. That combined with like a Canon air intake uh, will make these tubes completely unrestricted. that basically means is that the air will flow right in here and not hit a filter um they do make a noticeable difference i know that um you know dimitri said they don't uh and i really respect him but i think they add about 20 horsepower to be honest um and the reason why i say that is because the dynos show that in fact some of the dynos even show more like they're talking about 20 wheel horsepower dyno horsepower Dimitri brushed it off as like different runs, um, you know, can have that much of a difference on the same dyno, same engine, everything. And I mean, that's a really good point. I don't own a dyno. Uh, I'm thinking about building one maybe with like a Raspberry Pi, <laughs> but uh, they're really expensive. So uh, I understand his point. You know what I mean? Like, I think that is possible. Um, but on the other hand, I think that you know, from the seat of your pants and from the sound, it really makes a big difference.